Hi, I'm Diane Horton, and I'm here with David Liu to tell you about our work together with our colleague, Sheila McElwraith, on a pedagogy for embedding ethical considerations into course content. We'll talk about our experience doing this in computer science courses, but the approach is relevant across disciplines. So why did we embed ethics into computer science courses? Technology is shaping the way people live, work, and interact with each other, and it is mediating what we know about each other and the world around us. Graduates of our program increasingly find themselves designing algorithms and using data that raise ethical issues they may not be aware of or equipped to address. Courses that contemplate the role of technology in society have been a standard but often optional part of curricula for years. And an emerging alternative is to embed ethical uh, discussions as modules within computer science courses. This approach offers the opportunity to tie ethical issues to technical content at the moment students learn it and to have students engage with these issues repeatedly throughout their degree. The Embedded Ethics Education Initiative is a project at the University of Toronto within the Department of Computer Science in association with the schwartz riesman Institute for Technology and Society. Our objective is to develop and evaluate methods for endowing and empowering the next generation of scientists, educators, and technology developers with the knowledge, the skills, and incentive to incorporate ethical considerations in the study of computer science and as a design principle in the development of computer science technology throughout their careers. This project is the work of a multidisciplinary team of computer scientists, philosophers, members of the schwartz riesman Institute, and a psychologist. And here we see the current members of our team. In our first two years, our team has developed a set of pedagogical techniques that were honed to the development and deployment of embedded ethics modules and were assessed through a formal study. The modules we have developed so far are designed for five courses from first year to graduate level. They've been delivered to 2,500 students in courses for, ranging from introductory computer science to advanced machine learning. They've covered ethical issues, including privacy, disability rights, and fairness. And one overarching guiding principle for these modules has been no proselytizing, teaching students how to think, not what to think. Principled assessment has been a cornerstone of our work. In the first year, we ran a study comparing students who participated in modules to a control group. It showed that our pedagogical techniques were effective in achieving important goals, such as having the students feel safe discussing ethical issues. We also found that there was a significant increase in students' interest in ethical issues and technology and their confidence in identifying and discussing those issues. We are now conducting a longitudinal study that will look at the impact of participating in a series of modules over time. In our teaching and learning symposium talk, we'll describe the pedagogical strategies we employed and the goals they served. And we'll show some concrete examples of how these strategies were realized in the modules we developed. Although our modules have been developed for computer science courses, we believe our approach is relevant to embedding ethical discussions in any discipline. The Embedded Ethics Initiative is now entering a transition phase during which we'll develop and deliver six to eight new modules over the next three years. Our goal is for every computer science student to see at least one embedded ethics module per year for all four years of their degree with a total annual enrollment in the embedded ethics courses between 4,500 and 5,000 students. And working with colleagues in the Department of Philosophy, we'll also explore how to connect with and support those colleagues in other disciplines who are interested in adopting our embedded ethics approach. We're so proud of this work and the impact it is having on our students. Students often reported that their first module was eye-opening and we saw a lot of enthusiasm to learn more about ethics and technology. This work could not be coming at a more important time. If you're interested in learning more about the Embedded Ethics Education Initiative, please visit our website at the URL shown on the slide. We hope to see you at the Teaching and Learning Symposium, and thank you for watching this video.